that's our tickets. So you wear these on you. So we've had to be vetted to be able to get into the royal enclosure and this is what it's all about. Very excited, we're getting ready now. On our way to try and see the Queen and we're going through Great Windsor Park and you can actually see, I don't know whether you can, I'm hoping you can, you can see her horse and carriages. Um, they have got the Queen in yet, but obviously they're getting ready. So sat in the car, we are going to Royal, oh, there we go, there's my badge. Royal Enclosure, Miss Sally Jacks. And Gary's got his on. Gary's in top hat and tails today. Um, I've just shoved my hat hair up because I've got a, a big. Um, it's a. It, it looks like a hat, kind of on a band, but it's a. It's massive. Um, I'll show it you a bit later on, but I didn't want to wear it now, and I've got my flip flops on. So we've just pulled in to a place called Water. It was a road called Water Splash Lane, and it's uh, roughly around about half a mile from Royal Ascot. And actually, my brother's wife her mum lives on here and the queen actually travels down by carriage but not many people know this only people really that are local to the area know about it even though she's been doing it for years and it happens every but it's the only sort of public road that she hits in her carriages and my brother said it's that good you can actually the queen is like you're on the pavement the queen's on the road it's you're that close because it's only a small road you'll see it because i'll film it all and uh, my brother said it's so good she waves at you she's almost like she looks you in the eye so i really wanted to see this bit now unfortunately because of this we will probably miss the first race at royal ascot but um it's kind of a compromise because i really want to go to royal ascot it's on my bucket list but gary is a big horsey fan so he really wants to do this but i really want to see the queen although i met her when i was when i was younger i really do want to see the queen so um we know what to do we know where to stand and we know to go on the other side of the road um so if you do ever come here you'll know to come down this road in future so i'm just gonna go we're gonna go round the corner to a pub now because they've actually got if you can see i'll show you um a woman opens this field that she owns so everybody can park their cars to see the queen on this road but it's not busy there's a lot of yummy mummies with the prams. We're the only ones dressed up. So they're probably thinking, why are you not going to the race course? But we really want to see this. So we're going to go round the corner uh, to the pub and then I'm going to come back and then we're going to be filming it. And then, of course, I'll film uh, being in Ascot as well, Royal Ascot. They've got public loos here. You know them public loos? I can't know whether you can see them. See them. I don't want to. Uh, guarded by a policeman yeah i don't really want to use them so we're going to go to the pub and have a quick drink see you later so we've walked up water splash lane turn right right again and then we've ended up on a road called cheapside, cheapside lane it's and cheap. it's not very cheap but it's very lovely and there's a place called the thatched cavern that was <laughs> I think Sid, Sid sang here. Sid, 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 Sid did a gig in the back. <laughs> <laughs> the champagne, and there's loads of people having um, there's loads of people having lunch here in their um, uh, top hat and tails. But obviously they've all taken off the top hat and tails. So I'm just having a glass of champagne, very clear. And uh, and then we're going to walk up and see the Queen, then go in. <laughs> Just, I know it's cheap side lane and uh, water splash road and this apparently is where the carriages come up and she slows down there's quite a few crowds but it's not heaving my brother said you are better further down on water splash lane but apparently we spoke to a, um, a little old woman who was walking a dog and she said that they have to slow down the carriages at this point because she's going around the corner near the helicopters so apparently she's just got into she's just, she's just got into her carriage um, at Great Windsor Park and then she'll be coming up and he'll signal to us when she's here so I'll record it all. So you don't have as many people as what you would think there was going to be. It's nowhere near as big as did Disney parades. Revolve helicopter revolve making a racket that's obviously making sure part of her security. puppets because there's a school kids that they've got puppets look at that the policeman because there's a school um there's a kids school just further down the road and they do it for the kids that are on the line and which i think is absolutely lovely so 
So we've got the motorcyclists coming up, so that was just to clear the road. What a lovely idea to have puppets like that for the kids. Here we go, so you've got two mo motorcyclists and then they're behind there. Another motorcyclist. And another one. The old wave to the kids, isn't that lovely? Oh, I wish Fanky Fat could see us like that, aren't they? We'll have to bring him down one here to see it. He has to see it. Oh boy, not next year. It's security guards, isn't it? That's the security guards in that one. So here we go. Oh my word, I'm so close, I can't go over it. God, look how beautiful that is. See that, Kate? Oh, look at the puppets! Look at the puppets! <laughs> oh my God! Puppets. puppets, look! Look at the puppets! It's fabulous! That look at that! <laughs> Lots of cars behind, which is obviously all her security that comes out the day. Jesus, how much does this cost? Wow! Look at him with a corgi. He's got a corgi. <laughs> Big bird. I wonder whose idea it was to use the puppets. Lovely idea, isn't it? That's obviously um, how they came out of the carriage. They're obviously travelling in those cars. They travel behind them and then they'll probably come back in those. So cute, they've all got the yellow vests on, all the little kids have got the yellow vest on from the, it's either the primary school or the nursery school, come out to see the, the, the Queen. I bet they bring a different class out every day to see them and I think it's brilliant. Just back from our Ascot trip and you're probably wondering, well where was Ascot on there? Well I decided to, when I was looking at it, to put them both separately, so I've done the Queen on one day and then I'll do Ascot on another. I hope you've enjoyed it, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and please press that subscribe button, it's always lovely to have you on board. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.